Gamecocks coming into the swamp, bringing in a six and one record, a four and one record in the SEC, and it doesn't look good from the start as Connor Shaw fumbles. Laurenti McCoy recovers at the one yard line, and from there, it's all Jeff Driscoll as he finds Jordan Reed in the end zone, putting the Gators up seven to nothing early. And the Gamecocks respond, they drive down at a field goal, not looking too bad, seven to three at this point, but later in the game, Ace Sanders is gonna field a punt, return it a couple of yards, and there goes the ball. Florida comes up with it, and that leads to another Jeff Driscoll touchdown as he is going to find Quentin Dunbar from 13 yards out. He evades some tacklers, goes in from there, putting Florida up 14 to three. Later, Demir Bird's gonna field the kickoff. And again, special teams not able to hang on to the ball. This time it's recovered by Solomon Patton, gets down to the one yard line. And from there, Jeff Driscoll finds Jordan Reed in the back of the end zone. Reed's second touchdown, Driscoll's third putting the Gators up 21 to three. South Carolina adds another field goal and they go into halftime down 21 to six. In the third quarter, Trey Burton in the Wildcat is gonna hand off to Omarius Hines and he's gonna go in from six yards out, putting the Gators up 27 to six. Florida's gonna add a Caleb Sturgis field goal from 42 yards out. 30 to eight at this point. And then Jeff Driscoll is going to find Frankie Hammond Jr. from six yards out, bringing the score to 37 to eight in favor of the Gators. The Gamecocks would add another field goal as Adam Yates hits a 30 yarder, 37 to 11 at this point. But Florida puts it out of reach if it wasn't already out of reach as Matt Jones runs in from a yard out. Final score. Florida 44, South Carolina 11. Hunter Banks, Capital City Sports.